Alright now, I'm tired as hell. Been gone for a while. Look at here, look at here. Look at here, look at here. Here, here. Um, life update. I've been doing a lot, whole lot, kind of transition. Um, over the course of the next six months to a year, I'm gonna be transitioning as far as uh, my career path. So going back to IT versus um, banking industry and the servicing side of things that I've been doing. Anyhow, enough of that. Um, as far as the beard goes, my barber may have had a bad day on listening to my instruction. So, um, I had a lot of long whiskers underneath my chin that didn't have the same length is everything that was underneath my beard because I asked for him to cut me, which I thought he had shears or thought he understood that I wanted just a light trim and he went ahead and chopped off a whole lot underneath my chin. And uh, I kind of grow slow uh, hair underneath my chin. So I'll show y'all, you'll probably be able to see um, of a little trail, uh, a, a, a patch underneath my chin. But anyhow, update for me, got a few new lenses, pancake lens, um, uh, extendo zoom lens. I'm uh, gonna be getting adapters and uh, probably uh, Nikon and Minolta and uh, old vintage lens to interchange with um, what I already have set up. But anyhow, products I've used for my beard. Scott Porter, you see they plastered all over the internet. You know, they pay for advertisement all over Facebook. You might can see a few, um, you know, YouTube tutorials on this um, online. Um, but maybe if you're mixed or Caucasian or just something other than <laughs> myself, <coughs> you probably have a better chance at using this. Been using it for a few months. It smells good. It's decent. It's thick, sort of, so to speak. It smells decent, but I just feel like it, it like blocks my pores and my hair feels hard after a while, so. It's not the best move for me. <clears throat> this, on the other hand, a friend referred this to me. A friend of a friend, and my barber uses this, so. Yeah. You may want to pause and zoom in. Let me see if I can get it to focus. that you may want. Anyhow, that's it for me as far as products I use. Pickups I got as far as non-hair related type of products. I got my kit lenses which I already said. I'm not going to pull those out the bag. I'll sneak ahead out there. Any OG heads out there, can y'all tell me what the difference was in between the materials on these bad boys? Coppers. And I got two pair of these. 
one eleven and a half, which is shown here in a size twelve. So for you box heads out there. See, and I'm going to show you. Well, I don't know if I should post this or get an edge up before I post this, but either way, that's what's going to happen. Um, here you go. Gonna spray, man, because this stuff gets kind of dry. You know how it go. Olive oil. stuff around the edges and I'm gonna be live just a little something new for y'all because I don't really see anybody out there really just be showing hairstyles that want all y'all little lock kids out there and y'all know y'all let's let it dangle or y'all do the you know halfway to the back which I started off doing um, I just switched it up because I should probably be different. You know, you always see photos of dudes with live hairstyles and what have you. And they be quick clips. Well, now you got something live and direct. So, you're welcome. Um, any other forms of social media? Um, trying to figure out, was there anything new out there in the lock community? I've actually been, i really just been too busy. I know a lot of people say that, um, that they've been too busy or they've been sick or they've been dealing with school and I understand life happens, but yeah, I just felt I should just hold back from, from a lot of updates until I get a lot of things, you know, that I can actually execute on. Like I'm in the process of buying a house right now. I'm in the process of, um, you know, doing a lot of things, transitioning career-wise and, you know, things of that sort. So, uh, also, um, I'm going to be traveling uh, this year a lot, um, well, at least I plan to at least twice before the end of this year. And we're already pretty much halfway through 2016, so imagine that. Um... Follow me on any other uh, sources of uh, social media. I'm on Instagram, really. Mm, better than that, I kind of sit there and watch you guys on YouTube. Like, comment on a few things here and there. But I'm definitely here. When I'm not posting, I'm definitely, definitely watching you guys' videos and whatnot. But anyhow, man, um, follow me on all social media, on Instagram, at Black Fabio King. That's all one word. Um, but yeah, I'll salute you guys out there. Uh, if you like what you see, 
Drop something in the comment section below. Any tips, tricks, or pointers you may uh, want to share with me, I'll share with you. As I always say in my videos, like, comment, subscribe. Oh, and I forgot to say, um, this hairstyle I actually attempted like June 27th. If y'all go back and look at my June 27th video, y'all know that this was the original attempt. Well, for the most part, you know, it was supposed to be a big bun. But, you know, I don't have a hair length like that. That takes some time. And I'm underneath two years. Y'all be able to tell more better than me. I can't keep up. I know I'm I know I'm over a year and a half. Probably like by a month or so. I don't know. When it's posted, you guys will know. Um, you guys will be able to keep up better than I am. I don't post a lot of videos. I think I should though. Come later on this year. We'll figure it out. Um, it's just that I just gotta figure out how I'm gonna get some more creative content out to you guys. So anyhow, you see the photo, I mean you see the video, you see the clip. You see the starting of it. You really don't see the ending of it. Except for the top. So nothing's dangling. But yeah. I'll probably post another clip after this. Or I'll probably just make it a separate, uh, whole other separate video. And it'll just be a quick two minute rundown of the quick edge up. But yeah. Like, comment, subscribe, y'all.